are you apologizing for what you what you posted? Um, when the president apologizes, I'll apologize, but I'm not apologizing for being frustrated and angry at a bigot that we have in our White House. I understand you told the star that, that posting it was wrong. Yes, it was, and that's why I deleted it. And have you had a do-over, what would you say instead of calling for his assassination? Um, well, I didn't call for that. That's not what, what I put on my Facebook page. Um, and in fact, I was responding to someone else's post um, from my original posting that I put up talking about the trauma and frustration and anger that many residents have. Um, but I would absolutely say that this president that we have is causing an absolute mess. It, we have not revisited this moment in time since Jim Crow. And he is allowing, with his support of white supremacists, he is allowing for more racism to occur institutionally and systematically. So when he apologizes for his behavior as the, the president of the United States, I'll apologize, but um, I did not intend to put that up there. It was absolutely wrong, but I am not for any reason going to shy away from uh, standing up for the, the voices of people who feel as though um, we have someone who's taking away, away their civil rights and discourse. There's been a, at least one call that we're aware of for your resignation. What's your response I'm, to that? Absolutely not. That's ridiculous. Have you been contacted by the Secret Service? No, not at all, but, you know, I'll tell them the same thing I'm telling everyone else. It was something that's inappropriate. Um, they don't have to worry about me. They have to worry about all the other people who the, the, the president is angering. Um, but, you know, it, as I said, it was inappropriate, but I... I will continue to talk about the fact that we have a bigoted president in the White House.